welcome to a vlogmas on my channel. I'm so excited to have you guys here. I've never done vlogmas before. So I've been wanting to do vlogmas since I figured out what vlogmas was, which was only in July of this year. Forgive me, I haven't been on YouTube very long, so I've just been living under a rock. And even before I started YouTube, I didn't really actually watch very much YouTube. So I just kind of like jumped in and didn't really know what I was doing, but here I am. And I really was looking forward to doing vlogmas this year. This week, my plans have completely derailed. I was in the midst of the holiday sales edit. I've only uploaded three videos and there's supposed to be a new video every single day for seven days. But I got some really, really bad news. I also got sick and I've just been needing to spend all my time with my family right now. I really hope that you guys can understand that. It's just been really, really hard. I've literally been crying like most of the days. So obviously I don't wanna be here on camera with you guys. So things are okay right now. So here I am bringing to you guys a little bit of Vlogmas content. Now, I'm hoping to get day four of the holiday sales edit up tomorrow and finish the holiday sales edit this week because there's a lot of amazing sales that are still going on and they're gonna be going on right up until Christmas. And if you don't manage to pick up any of these things I share with you guys, before Christmas, then of course come Boxing Day and even as we move into January, all of these things are gonna be hardcore on sale. So I thought I would start the vlog off today. I think we're around 11.30 in the morning on Sunday with some of the things that I actually purchased online on Black Friday that have finally come in. My Fair Isle sweater dress from Abercrombie has finally arrived. I actually ordered this in two different sizes, so I will have to return one. This one is the small in the petite size, but I also picked up the extra small in regular sizing. It seems like it's gonna be a really, really warm top. There's definitely wool in it. The sleeves seem really nice. I love the gorgeous Fair Isle print and the blue. This is quite a festive holiday piece, but if you guys are going on any holidays or especially ski holidays over the winter months, you're going somewhere cold, this would be so cute on a ski holiday as well. I also picked up another pair of over the knee boots. I spotted these ones on the Nordstrom website. They're the brand Chinese Laundry and I fell in love with the color. Like how stunning is this color? It's actually coming up a little bit lighter on camera but they're slightly darker in person. Online they call them a mink but they're definitely kind of like a taupe light brown color. They have an inside zip closure. I love the block heel. It's quite stable but definitely gives you a really good height boost. I love the shape of the toe. It's more of an almond shape. It has ties at the top here. It's almost kind of like a corset style. I think that's quite nice. And they look like quite a slim fitting boot. So these are, I think, a really good dupe for a pair of Stuart Weitzmans. Stuart Weitzmans are on sale 50% off on the Nordstrom website right now. If you guys want to get your hands on those, I mean, I know I definitely do, but like $400 US dollars on a pair of boots just seems like kind of frivolous, but like, I don't know, I'm debating it. Anyways, these ones are under 90, so a fraction of the price. They're a beautiful color, and I think these are so versatile. You can really wear them for fall, winter, or spring, which I'm really looking forward to. I really am so excited to start styling these up with a lot of different things that I already have in my wardrobe. I'm gonna save the best thing for last. So I have a couple beauty things that came in from my Sephora order. I actually ordered a ton of stuff during their VIB Beauty Insider sale, but I have a few recommendations for you guys that I think would make really great gifts for other people as well. So I ordered the Becca Glow Macon Collection set. I actually don't own any highlighters, as crazy as that sounds, but these just really appealed to me because you get four different highlight colors and they're definitely travel friendly. So since I'm a flight attendant, for those of you who don't know, I'm actually a flight attendant and I do that full time. I just do YouTube as a hobby. I'm always looking for travel size items, but like good quality travel size items. So I think these are perfect. I love the shade range. So the top one is the opal. The middle top one is the vanilla quartz, the rose quartz is the pink one, and then the prismatic amethyst on the bottom. So this one retails for 48 Canadian dollars. I mean, I think that's really good value because it retails full price for 92 Canadian, so it's a really good value set. I think it's 40 US dollars. So I think this set would make for like a really good stocking stuffer or a gift for someone, or if you're shopping for like a bunch of your girlfriends or doing a secret Santa, you could actually divide them all up and give one of them something separate. I think that'd be really cute to do like a little kind of like beauty goodie bag for one of your girlfriends especially for like a secret sound or something like that or if you know a girl that loves highlight and then you can kind of choose the ones that are like perfect for that particular friend that's such a good idea I should do that with my friends anyways I really wanted to recommend this to you guys the formula is beautiful 
I also picked up the Go To Glow set by Clinique. I love the Clinique skincare brand. I love that they combine makeup and skincare. I think that's really important. And the reason why I picked this one up for myself is because there's a lot of products in here that I've been actually really wanting to try. And I thought in a value set, that's a great option. They have some mini size and some full size products. Again, really great for traveling as well. And then rather than shelling your money all out on all the full size items that way you can test them all out and see which ones you like the first product that like i am really wanting to try is the take the day off bomb basically this is supposed to like melt off your makeup and like i am all about that life they also have the take the day off makeup remover a chubby stick i love the chubby stick and then they also have the moisture surge which is really well rated as well and that's actually a full size product so an amazing value set this one retails for 53 canadian dollars it's a 135 dollar value i mean you can totally see why this would make for an amazing gift for you know yourself your mom your one of your girlfriends your aunt any like special lady in your life especially if you know that they love the clinique brand this is such a good set and the last thing that's coming so far for my black Friday orders is my new camera bag from Coach. I am so excited about this bag. I initially spotted it on Bloomingdale's website, but I actually ordered it off of 6pm.com because I found it for a little bit cheaper. I went into the Coach store on Black Friday because they had 30% off, which I thought was an amazing deal. And they told me that the camera bag in Canada did not come in this floral print. They had a smaller bag, but I was really after a bag that I could fit my camera in. And I know this is like a really florally print. You guys are thinking, why did you order this? But I ordered it with spring and summer in mind when premium designer items go on sale and you spot something you like or is on your wish list you got to pick it up so a lot of actually my orders for Black Friday have been kind of more forward thinking with spring and summer in mind this bag I think is absolutely stunning I'm actually surprised because there is some sparkle on it hopefully that's coming up in the video so it's kind of like a rose gold bronze sparkle I love the gold hardware detail on this bag so it's kind of a muted gold it has a nice ring detail with the little tassel on it and the zipper just glows slides across the bag which I love it has a forward pocket it has a back pocket and inside it looks like it's going to be quite spacious so there's a pocket right here that will definitely fit your phone and then also has a zip pocket on the inside for any of your extra valuables but I'm so excited about it I think it's going to be the perfect addition to my spring and summer wardrobe and I believe I paid around 131 US dollars for the bag <laughs> So Antoine and I are at this place called Art Naps right now and the Christmas decor here is absolutely stunning. It's also a little bit on the pricey side, but it is so beautiful. on my deck I'm gonna string some Christmas lights I think it's almost three o'clock and like as you can see it's already starting to get a little bit dark outside but we've done no lights yet so I want to do some on my deck I'll show you guys there's literally nothing on this deck so I think some lights will really kind of brighten it up however I just realized we don't have an extension cord so I'm gonna have to run out to Home Depot but I want to get this done while it's still daylight and I'm gonna attach it with some fishing wire and some scissors and let's just hope for the best took the tripod out. Let's try that again. looks but I don't have the extension cord to turn them on but you know what two strings worked out absolutely perfectly I don't have any excess on the sides I don't need to use that one which is awesome the fishing string you actually can't really see it like if I bring the cameras really close then you can see it so I'm actually just gonna trim off the loose ends 
and I'm really happy with it. All right, so I'm on our rooftop deck. We obviously don't come up here very much in the winter, but I wanted to share it with you guys because we do have a pretty nice view up here. And then you can see why we spend all of our time on this part of our home using this deck and not on the lower deck. This is actually the view from our deck. It's really pretty, especially this time of day. So those are actually the Rocky Mountains in the background. For those of you who don't know, I live in Vancouver, Canada, and actually on this one right here, you can see that there's a little bit of snow. I'm just gonna head downstairs now and get the extension cord, and then hopefully we'll be able to light up the lights on our deck. All right, so the extension cord is now attached, and here are the lights on our back deck. I think they look really fun and festive. My mom and dad actually gave me these lights since they had some extras. So I love the way that they turned out. It just kind of makes it look a little bit more fun and festive. And as you can see in the background, some of our neighbors has some lights as well. Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna show you the most exciting part, I think, of this entire video which was our recent purchase. So today we went out not just to go to look at Christmas decorations, but for this purchase in particular. And it is our new TV. So exciting. So we actually have been wanting a new TV for quite a while now. So we got the Samsung 55 inch 8 series and we actually got a boxing day pricing on this television. And we don't actually have to go in there on boxing day. This is our cute little Christmas tree. Isn't she beautiful? We're going for very much a woodland theme. So we have some beautiful decorations on our tree. Like how cute is that little squirrel? This one's from Pier 1. The butterflies are from Walmart. We have tons of Walmart decorations on here. This one's from Walmart the poinsettia, so is this little guy. This one is two. The A is from Target. We have an L, we have a cute photo of us. And here she is, the Samsung 8 series. It looks spectacular. So we're actually gonna be doing an entire built-in on this wall. The cords will most certainly not be showing. We're obviously gonna get some new chairs. My parents gave those to us. But yeah, it's gonna be a completely built-in. I added these cute little shutters. These are just from Hobby Lobby as kind of an added design decor detail. And then we're actually gonna put a mantle here and until we get our floors done in January so we can at least hang these stockings. Then we have our electric fireplace down below. So I'm going to end the vlog here. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed spending the beginning of December with me and that you guys are having a great start to your December as well. If you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. That means so much to me, you guys. I have loads more Vlogmas content coming to my channel and of course my regular fashion content. So the fashion videos, I'm gonna try and upload at least twice a week and then there'll be loads of Vlogmas content in between or even double content on some of those days. So if you like what you've seen so far, I'd love it. If if you'd hit the red subscribe button down below and spend a little bit more time with me here on my channel that would mean so much to me and I just love to have you guys here with me I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I can't wait to see you all again here in my next video bye